Hey there, Kevin Madden with the AES Worship Sound Academy here in Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, we're here uh, supporting meaningful workshop, workshops and trainings for mainly church audio people here. There's some fantastic classes going on. Um, here in the exhibit room, we're showing a good chunk of our product line and a lot of peripherals. For example, the D-Live S-Class system here. It's a 128 by 64 bus machine running at 96K. Um, more germane is the new Avantis console. So this guy is a 64 by 42 bus, two huge, generous, high-def touchscreens. Um, fully configurable, very much like a D-Live, sort of in a truncated hardware package. Um, other things to point out that are pretty important about our system that sometimes people overlook is these peripheral controllers. So you can see we have these IP remotes that can you know, do various things. Um, they can be external controllers uh, programmed to run in sort of a custodial mode. Um, we're obviously showing Waves integration with our system here. The DLive does have an option of a 128 channel 96K Waves card. I don't think that's something most people have. Um, also with Avantis is uh, the new app that's running it. That just came out. Uh, we have a custom control app that's sort of an end user, again, sort of custodial mode operation that you can run a DLive with, program your own faders. And of course our uh, ME1 personal monitoring station, very popular in church environments where people can mix themselves. And last but not least is uh, the SQ5. So this is the smallest of three frames. It's a 16 fader frame, but it is a 48 by 20 stereo box mixer. All of these are using the 96K FPGA XCVI core processor. So we're glad to be here.